Good morning, my peeps. Good morning, and I love you. Happy Thursday at long last. I go home today, and I can't tell you how much I'm looking forward to it. Um, forecast is shady. We got a long line of thunderstorms going to be moving through the area uh, later today, so I'm hoping to get out and be well on my way before it hits. Um, so try to race it home. And for you guys that are going through that line, you know, be careful, be safe. My prayers are with you as always. And uh, throw up a prayer for me. You know, I hate these drives and driving through a thunderstorm is not my idea of a good time. I don't think it's anybody's idea of a good time. But uh, let me text Daniel, let him know I'm waiting outside and get this day done. <laughs> I love you guys. Talk to you in a bit. Freedom! <laughs> I am free! All right, guys, I gotta stop at the gas station and hit the road. Trying to beat that line of th thunderstorms. I don't think I'm gonna make it all the way home before it hits, but I'm gonna do my best and I'm gonna be very careful. Thank you so much for praying for me. I'm praying for you. <sighs> Father, please, you know my nerves, but get me home safe and quick. <laughs> Talk to you soon, guys. Love ya. just say something about toilet paper I've suffered I mean I'm not a snob but single ply really at the hotel at my employers so I just stopped here at South Carolina the Welcome Center just across the state line I go to a bathroom a public bathroom off the highway and they have better toilet paper than a hotel or my employer. So I just thought I'd share that. Food for thought. What's the deal with the single ply? Sandpaper, toilet paper. Anyway, kudos to South Carolina Welcome Center. Thank you for providing decent toilet paper. <laughs> I'm tired. Got about another hour to get home, but I'm almost there and there's actually sunshine crossing my fingers that I'm going to get home and not have to deal with the rain at all. All right, guys, back to it. Made it home, my peeps, with all my stuff. Stopped at Ingalls, as you can see, and I think I'm going to cook tonight. I think I'm just so excited to be home that I want to cook. <laughs> I missed my new pressure cooker. So I was gonna do some um, Cuban pork with onions and I got some like uh, torpedo rolls, you know, sub rolls from the bakery. Make some pork sandwiches. Pan con lechon. Now I'm just waiting on Glenn and Allie to get home. They're picking up Chewy. And then I get to greet my family. Oh man, I missed them and I was homesick. So I'm glad to be back. <gasps> Hi, Vian, little Vian. <laughs> oh, I missed you. Oh my goodness. Got a package from my mom. She paid 30 bucks to send me olive oil, cooking wine, keratin for my hair, and these kitchen rags you know, for me to cut up, because these are the things we were looking for when she was here. Oops, come on, phone to focus. There you go. My mother, my mother, crazy lady. Now that my kitchen has been set to rights, I'm ready to cook a meal. Picked up these little, plain little pork loins, boneless, skinless pork loins at Ingalls. Going to throw some seasonings on them, slice up a couple onions. I think I need to slice these and then this should have some sort of saute feature or so I thought. Yes, right here. And uh, going to go ahead and saute the onions, throw the pork in there, 
And where's that bread? Oh, here it is. Here's the bread that I bought. Has some delicious pork sandwiches. All right, guys, let's get started. Man, that Cuban coffee oh, and a home-cooked meal. Can I tell you how awesome that was? <laughs> anyway, guys, just going to walk Chewy here, get ready for bed, and look. Look at my maple. The light's crummy, but it's all yellow. So I didn't miss the whole show, but it sure did change a lot in just a short time I was gone all right guys I love you tons and tons gotta get some rest man finally my own comfortable bed <laughs> I'll see you in the morning good night